Welcome to Sports Facts Betting. How you doing, guys? My name is Gene. Of course, WNBA. Let's continue with our betting, guys. I saw some of you comments. Yes, I'm going to do the play player prop. The only thing is, well, like I was saying, when I click on here, it doesn't show my player prompts. I can't go and click that yet because they haven't up updated. So what I'm going to do here is that I'm going to go to underdog and technically just go off of what I have here and put, you know, and still um, choose the team plus a player for each one. That's what I'm going to do. Hopefully you guys like it. So once again, if you guys are playing to bet, I have underdog, the link is in my description. Click on that so we can both bet together or you could do the hard rock one, the hard rock bet. I have that link also so we could bet together. Let's start this process. All right, so it's September 11 and we have three games. One game I think is gonna be freaking good is Aces versus Fever. All right, let's start looking, all right. So we have nobody that's injured right now. The team stats, as you can see, Aces have 86.4 to Fever's 84.7. Um, you have them, oh wait, Fever has more, or well, was the better stats on their rebounds. Um, Fever have 35.4 to Aces, 34.2. We have tie on the assists, Blocks, Aces have them over that, the five point to their 4.6. And then steals, Aces have that too. Mm. Okay, now look at the last five games that they played. Um, Aces lost against Liberty and Fever lost against Lynx. Good games too. Everybody's, man, this is going to be a very good game. So now the last two games, it seems that Aces been kicking ass but once again fever is a different team we gotta be we gotta admit it now all right come on caitlin clark is going to win that rookie of the year come on now we have wilson with that well i'm not gonna be talking about wilson right now but caitlin clark come on she's doing really good the team is doing good awesome on that but man you guys might not like what i'm about to say here but <laughs> I think we're gonna pick the underdog here, guys. I'm gonna pick the underdog. Now, let me just make sure. Cause you know, I don't wanna just pick whatever. Oh, oh, sorry. Let me get back to the WNBA. All right, all right. Look, Suns is winning, just letting you know. All right, so what I can do, even though I'm rooting for the Fever, I think Fever could definitely beat Aces. Aces been you know, even though they still have a good record, even though they're doing great, you know what I'm saying? But there's some games I'm like, what the hell? You're losing from wings. You're losing from, like, different, like, technically, sorry, teams. Like, Ace is supposed to win every freaking game. I can understand Liberty. I can understand Storm. I can understand, you know, certain different players. But when I'm be seeing you losing against not-so-great teams and then or or getting to a close game with not so great teams, that's a concern I have a little bit with Aces. Just letting you know. Now guys, I, I know, I'm pretty sure you see the Dolphins here. I do have the link in my description or somewhere around, I will put the link, but I did do a player prop on the Dolphins versus Bills game. Go check that, that, that one out too, just letting you know. All right, but I will definitely pick the fever but let me go with the spread here okay because if they don't beat them right like off rip it'll be a close game i do not think ace is going to beat fever like 10 20 points and same thing with fever i don't think they're going to beat aces like with crazy points so let me go and check and look man it's so close so close they don't even give me like some good decent points you got the plus 4.5 and then you got the negative 4.5. I'm going with Ace, guys. You know, fever, I mean. I'm going with Fever. You might think I'm going crazy here. But I am going with Fever with the spread. With the 4.5. Because I think it's definitely going to be a close game. Look at their stats are pretty close, too. Like, if you look at their stats, they're pretty close. The only thing that they have against Fever is their rebound, right? Um... No, actually, Fever 
has their rebound against aces, right? Um, aces have points against the few. They're they're very neck and neck, you know. Steals, that's a different story. But I don't think they're gonna get steals, man. They're not gonna get the steals like that against Fever like that. No, I don't. Even though I see this game, I see Fever losing in this game by nine points. And then you have the second game they lost by yeah, a good amount of points. But I just don't think this game three is going to be a a very like dominant game. I just don't think so. Both teams are healthy. Everybody is doing great. Fever is doing amazing. We got to give him that. Fever is doing amazing, man. And they had a great win off Dreams. Yeah, I see Fever could win this. They could definitely win this. And I'm going to go with the spread. I'm going with the spread for Fever. All right. So now let's see the player prompt here. What should I go? Who should I go for? Okay. You could go with Wilson here with the 26.5, right? Let me see. Wilson is actually doing pretty good. But 20 points he did with, she did with the Suns. And then she did 30 points with mm, the Sky. Now right, let's go and check their last game. Let's go with Wilson. Let's click that. Because I don't want to check in each, every player. Wilson will be one of the ones I would pick. Or it's going to be... Uh, Casey Mitchell for from the fever and most likely I will go with the points over there too but okay so he she scored 28 points the last game she played fever I definitely think she could definitely get that still but the last five games right she had 20 here you had 26 here everything else higher 30 41 or 42 she's doing good right but at the same time, if we look for Case, yeah, Mitchell, if we look for her, she they always stick with her with the 20.5. As you can see, 21, 23. Uh, she did do 18. Oh, and that is against the, that is against the Aces. All right, let me check that. Let me go. Let's check out the stats. This is what we do, guys. Um. Where she at? She scored 23 in the last game when she played Aces. And let me see here. This is when she spoke Spark. Come on. Every wow. Well, look. 21, 23, 18. Everything else, it went over the 20. So I, I gotta go with her. I gotta go with her. Mitchell will be the one. I'm gonna go higher. So we got Fever to win, and we have Mitch to go 20.5, okay? That is the first pick, okay? Let's go with the second pick here. Let's go. Let me go back. Second pick. We have Sky versus Mystique. Now, let me go and check out their stats. Of course, I would definitely go with Sky. And then we have Carter back, and most likely... We should have Angel back. Let me see if Angel is still her. Angel. Oh, it's game time. So we won't know until the last minute. But let's see. Mystique won the first. Mystique won the... Oh, my gosh. So, actually, no. Sky won the first game. In the last two games, Mystique been winning. Washington been winning. Ooh, that is not good. Mm-mm. And I want to go with Sky. It's not like feelings. I just feel like Sky is a better team. Sky is definitely the better team. Let me let me go back here and check out their stats. Look. Ooh, points. No. No, Mystique has them over the points. It's 79.3 to 78.9. Um, well, rebounds, the, of course, Chicago got that. Um, no, but the assist they're good at. Block, no, it looks like, ooh, ooh-wee. Mm-mm. On the stats here, it shows me that Mystique should be winning this game. 
even though the prediction is here. And you don't have Angel Reese. But I think sometimes it is a good thing that they don't have Angel Reese. They do focus on uh, Cordosa. And Cordosa did a really good job in the last game. You know? Ooh, okay. This is, this is, this isn't. Let me see how much points did she give. Because Angel Reese, her, her, her issue right now, she's doing great with her rebounds, but her issue is offense. She needs offense. Yeah, you can get all the rebounds you want, but you need at least to, you know, get 80% back and give out some offense here. She gave only seven points here. She might be more of a problem on that sense than the solution. So, but I'm still going to give it, I have to give it to Sky. Let me go check out there. I, you know, I feel like I'm dragging this one a little bit. I apologize, guys. Look. Mm. And Mystique is the underdog? Guys, I guess I'm going for a second underdog here. This one is actually pretty tough here. Let me see. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We got the total is 121.5. Let's see. Let's see. The first game that they did was one. That's the zero. Put this one. That would be eight. Eight. You know what? I think I'm doing all of this, guys. We're going to get some calculator up in this. <laughs> all right. So we got seven, nine plus 71 gives me. Oh, no. That's not a good one. That was in the first game. And then we have 81 plus 83 equals 164. And then we have the third game will be 74 plus 70. And that gives us 144. So technically I will go with the under for that one too. But to make more bread and I feel like Mystique could definitely get this win. I am going with the underdog here. That's it. Or, you know what? Let's just go and give ourselves two points. Just in case. Let's go with the spread. We're going with Mystique. And that's it. And now, who I will pick for that, and hopefully they'll show it, is Cordosa. Because if you do not have... You don't have Angel Reese there, right? Most likely... Look at the rebounds. Look at that. She definitely will get her 10 rebounds. So we're going to go with the 9.5 with Cordosa, okay? So remember, we're going to go with Mystique with the win, and Cordosa will be my young lady to get her 10 rebounds, okay? Now let's go with our last pick. All right, and we have Storm and Sparks. Straight up, we're going with Storm. That's it. With the money line straight up, they're going to win. I don't even need to look at stats for that one, right? But one thing we should be looking at is because you guys want to play a prompt with it, and I'll definitely provide that to you guys. So let me go check out the stats. Click on that, the last game that they played. Me personally, I will definitely go with Oh, Diggins. So she got only eight points here on the last game that they played. Lord, uh, no. I would like to go with the assist here. Oh, no, no, no. My girl, Jackson. And I'm pretty sure she's getting the points in this game, too. And uh, the game that's still happening now. But Jackson, I'm going with Jackson. Jackson is very consistent with her stuff. Let me go check her out. Let's see if they put her. Oh, no. They didn't put her here. You see? Because I'm doing this guy so late or I guess early that they haven't put all the players up. But I still want to give you guys one more. One more here. And I like digging. She, she's good. Uh, going with the assist, though. The 5.5. Let me go check this out. Let me check her out here. Let me click on that. I like Diggins. Diggins get her assist. Look, 
11, 6, 3. Look, so it's only one game out of the five she was under 5.5. So we're going to go with the assist on that. We're going 5.5, and that's it. So now, guys, look. I am going with the Mystique, Washington. I'm going with Storm. Well, Washington with the spread, the two, uh, plus 2.5. Storm, that's straight with the money line. And then we're going Fever, plus 4.5. So I got 200 dogs here to win this game. 200 dogs, right? And then, because, you know, Hard Rock is not providing the information, I had to go to Underdog Guys, and these will be my three top picks for the players on the same game. Okay, we got Mitch with the 20 point. Five, Rock Codosa with the rebounds with the 9.5. And we got my sexy girl. Don't tell my wifey. Um, Dingin Smith or Smith. We have her with the 5.5 assist. Now, guys, if you like the content, sorry it took so long. I'm sorry. This video kind of dragged my bad on that. But remember, guys, I have a game for dolphins versus bills i did the player prop for that one so check that out i will put the link one more time or at the end of the video click on that please guys just subscribe to my channel give this video a like always comment share it as much as you can share it to all your friends because i just need to start hitting a thousand views here guys gotta hit that i'll see you guys later to the next game i am out of here